Have you ever wondered what was going to happen to your drainage pipes that you put in the ground after a few years? Well, this should provide you with a good idea. Um, and I, I can't believe they sell a lot of this stuff. I've seen a lot of problems with it. And if it's not installed properly, there are even more problems. What you're looking at here is um, a section of the pipe that has been removed. Uh, it's clogged up, you know, what are you going to do with it? Clean it out, take it out and put another pipe in? Why? You're just going to end up with the same problems later on. The black arrows are pointing to the path where the pipe was and the white arrow is pointing to the, to the connection. It was actually connected to um, the rest of the pipe. I cut it off with a sawzall. It was going into the neighbor's property. Now you're looking at a different view of the pipe and you can see some of the dirt in there. It's probably about half full and that's that's about what most of the pipe was here. Half full, um, no more than that. And I would estimate that this pipe was installed at least for five years and again that's a guess. It could have been longer. Um, the black arrow is pointing to gravel that was installed over the pipe. Now this is an excellent idea if the pipe was um, covered with some type of a cloth that would keep the soil out. They do have um, special cloth for that and I don't know where if you can find that at your local home improvement centers because I know I have seen it down there in the past but I don't know if they still carry it today. So you might need to go to an irrigation supply um, place and again th that might not be a bad idea to go down there because these people are going to have a few more pointers for things that do work and don't work. Um, you know uh, because they deal with that stuff on a regular basis. So again look at all the dirt in there. The gravel you can see plenty of dirt. The gravel does not keep the dirt out of the pipe. The gravel just provides extra um, area for the dirt to eventually settle into like you've seen in the pipe. Um, here's another picture of the black arrow is pointing to all of the holes that are located inside of the pipe and so if you if you use your imagination, um, I'm pretty sure that you can figure out that the dirt and uh, clay, soil, sand can go through these little holes here. So there's a black arrow, two black arrows. These, pi these pipes have a variety of different um, holes going through them and you can see they're not they're not spaced too far apart. They look like they're every other ring um, you have a hole. So trust me, these, these holes fill up with um, dirt and it's not a bad idea if you have them um, going out to a street. If you're using um, pipes like these, you'd better keep them cleaned out regularly. Run, run some water through them, do whatever you can because once they're clogged, they're going to be tough to clean.